In this video, I want to go through an example of showing you how we can square root a square number. Now, recall that a square number is the result of multiplying an integer, a positive integer, by itself. So, 1 squared is 1, 2 squared is 4, 3 squared is 9, 4 squared is 16. So, 1, 4, 9, 16. These are square numbers. So I'm telling you that 324 is a square number, and we use this notation um, to represent the square root of 324. So the way that I'm going to do this is I'm going to utilise the unique factorization theorem, the fundamental theorem of arithmetic that we've looked at previously. I'm going to write 324 as the product of its prime factors. Now, in order to do that, I'm going to need my prime numbers. So I'm going to write down the first six, which were 2, 3, 5, 7, 11, and 13. So, 324. Is it divisible by 2? Okay, so yes, um, that would be 162. Now, 162 is not prime. Uh, 2 goes into 162, and that would be 81 times. Now, 2 doesn't go into 81. 3 goes into 81 27 times. 3 goes into 27 9 times. And 3 goes into 9 3 times. So 324 is 2 times 2 times 3 times 3 times 3 times 3. So 2 times 2 times 3 times 3 times 3 times 3. Now how does that help me? How does that help me find the square root? Well, essentially what I'm going to do is I'm going to rewrite this, but I'm essentially going to share it into two halves. So I can see that I've got two twos, so I'm going to have to have two and a two. So I'm sharing it into two bits. Then I've got four threes. So this half can have two of them, and this half can have two of them. Okay, so we've now got two times three times three, and two times three times three. Now, 2 times 3 times 3 is 2 nines, which is 18. So this is 18 times 18. So 324 is 18 squared. So the square root of 324 is 18. OK? Now, before uh, I start getting comments thrown at me, uh, it is just 18. OK? So when I write the square root of 324, okay, that is taken to be the positive square root. Otherwise, I would have to have a plus minus out the front. So this is not plus or minus 18, it is just 18, okay? That is what that notation means.